Hey, you guys, and welcome back to another reading, Divine Feminine, Divine Masculine. Let's see what's going on with you guys. I'm picking up on some new love, okay? <clears throat> Is somebody new that's coming into your life? This is a new person. This is somebody who you don't know at all. Like you, you don't know this person from a can of paint. Let's see what's going on with Divine Feminine, Divine Masculine. I hope you guys are blessed and well. Let's see what's here. For Divine Feminine, Divine Masculine. Somebody named definitely is Terry, Terrence or something like that. Clarence, Terry, something like that. Jerry, what's here for Divine Feminine and Masculine? I'm seeing a lot of shopping, too. So you may be going shopping with this person. Or you may be shopping for something to wear, like on a, on a date or something. Could be the thinking woman, broken heart. This is after some kind of breakup or something. So also, too, Divine Femme, that's going to be cautious of getting with someone just to get over someone, okay? Make sure you fully heal before you get into another relationship. What's here? Rest and rejuvenation. I'm seeing a lot of relaxing with this person. This person is really laid back or you're very laid back, okay? Archangel Chamuel is here. What else is here? Cornucopia. The vibes that I'm getting from you are just magnificent is what I heard. There's that victory energy at the bottom in this man holding a coin. I feel like you're with somebody or you're gonna be with somebody that's more on your level. Like, um, as, as far as the heart, matters of the heart, and also matters of, like, finances, like, somebody who you don't, you don't, um, you, you don't have to worry about them depending on you, and they don't have to worry about you depending on them. It's just kind of like whatever when y'all go out is what I feel. It's definitely something here about love. Somebody's been trying to block this for you, I mean, for a very, very, very long time. Or you have been trying to block somebody from love and it's just not going to work out like that. Okay, here, child, look, blossoming abundance. So you got cornucopia blossoming abundance. So your money's good. I'm picking that up too. There's that angel of balance. So you definitely could be a Virgo, okay? Because I was picking up some kind of energy like being very, very abundant in that Virgo reading. If you guys are not already subscribed, make sure you go subscribe to Love Peppermint. You're just working on yourself, whoever you are. And any illusions that somebody may be trying to paint to you, you're quickly getting over something. It's like you can tell. Like, it's it's like you can automatically see when somebody is on bull, period. Healer of the ages. Somebody here has been trying to copy you. You're a healer, and what they're doing is just illusions. Like, somebody's causing illusions, but to a lot of people as well. I heard Oswald. Geico is significant, too. You could have just switched your insurance to Geico or you could have just switched from Geico or Geico is significant to somebody. Under my feet, I feel vibration. So this could be an earthquake or something here too. Archangel Ariel is present. You got two archangels out here. Somebody named Vivian or Vincent. Yeah, you're just completely walking away from the past. I feel like you're walking away from things that don't serve you anymore. Things that, you know, just put you in a low frequency. You don't want anything to do with it, fan masculine. And I don't blame you, honey. I just truly don't. Angel of balance here, daughter, personal healing and happiness. And then you got the thinking man journey. There's something hidden under the moon here. And it's also a big blessing. This is like the ace of pentacles here. Like somebody's about to receive a huge windfall of money. It's something about like a huge amount of money here. I don't know what this is. Could be lottery winnings. It could be an inheritance. I don't know. But whoever this new person is, they're not deceiving. This person... This broken heart energy, I feel like it's coming up because you may be getting over something. Like, you may be getting over a breakup. Like, you could be, something could have happened about nine weeks ago, nine months ago, even nine years ago. Um, you may have not been with anybody or something like that. Or, you know, you just haven't found the right person or something, but the right person is here. Just don't do them wrong is what I heard here. Whoever this person is, don't treat them wrong, fam. Don't treat them wrong, that's something for sure. Do not treat this person wrong. Don't treat them how, um, you know, you were treated or, you know, it's, it's just something here about stability. I heard sapiosexual or something about being stable mentally, but it's, uh, it's like you got your bag and stuff together. So whatever this is, I mean, kudos and congratulations here. I heard somebody is working with your opposition as well. And I feel like they're an op too. If somebody is working with your op, they're also an op, period. Somebody is also getting a lot of opportunities blocked from them because they're working with somebody's opposition. 
yeah, disruption, and then you have universe there. So somebody's not going to be able to disrupt something, okay? So my last name is Fowler. Something about flounder is significant, so the little mermaid could definitely be significant to someone. Or, or literal fish like flounder. You're very passionate about something coming up here too, and you're also in your power, and you're being recognized for this. A lot of you guys, you're getting opportunities. Like, you're not going to miss anything here. I just feel like you shifted your whole entire frequency, and somebody did not see this coming. Somebody just thought that they had something down pat. What I said, Phil Messwin. Patience in the reverse, discontent and boredom. These are a bunch of losers here that are bored. That's in your energy, and they're mad because you're elevating. You're not declining. Something is significant about... um. Gordon Ramsay, okay? So you definitely could cook or you could have been on his show or somewhere. You may be going on a show. I'm hearing Hell's Kitchen. So you may have been on Hell's Kitchen. Intuition is here. So yeah, it's, it's something about you being able to intuitively know something. It's like, like I said, you're able to look at people right away, but like, yeah, you're full of bull. I'm not dealing with you. I'm not dealing with that. Solar place is chakra here. Somebody didn't see something coming. Love begins in the reverse. Somebody didn't see something coming and you just simply walked away from them and you had every right to. You were supposed to. You were supposed to walk away from this person to make room for new love. And also from something else. Y'all make sure y'all, if you are not subscribed to Love Peppermint, please go subscribe to that channel because that was a very, very deep message that I got. But um, it's, it was very, very detailed. It's, it's something in your energy that you need to get rid of to let new love come in or something. I heard all evil eyes were turned back to sender. And these the hoes need to see. And I'm trying to watch my mouth, bro. These folks, universe, it's time for something else to change. It's something it's coming in for you. Prosperity begins. It's like the Ace of Wands here. Well, that Passion United card is like the Ace of Wands. This is like the Ace of Pentacles. But it's something here regarding harmony. And somebody is suffering in silence for this. I don't feel like you care because whatever this is with this person, it's not a spiritual union. So you just don't care. It's something about you not caring. You're not giving into temptation. Some about peaches is significant. Temptation in the reverse. You could be dealing with a Capricorn, a Libra, or a Scorpio here. I don't know who this new person could be. Also, I heard like you're gonna you're gonna meet somebody. Like you're 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 you, whoever you are, you really about to be tested. Like you're gonna meet somebody that you really really like. Like you're gonna. But then, like, your dream person is going to come in. What I said. Like, somebody somebody that you have been asking for, but this person wasn't quite ready. They're going to all of a sudden be ready when you're with someone else. <laughs> like, ain't that normally how we go, fam masculine? That's normally how we go, right? <laughs> they never is ready until you're with someone else. But that's what it is. This person is going to be all up on you. They're going to be all on your radar. I'm telling you, bro. This is like the Ace of Swords, clarity, awareness here, for sure. But they don't got no love. Like this part, like you may want, you may think you want this person, but I don't think you really want this person. I feel like you would want the person that truly got loyalty to you, that's actually dedicated to something, that they stand for something. This other person doesn't have any morals. Like it's like you dream of this person. They may have money or something, but they don't. Like, this person is liable to leave you. Like, they're not loyal to one person. They can't be. Wisdom here. This is like Hierophant, High Priestess energy. Throat chakra in reverse. Heart chakra. This person's chakras are closed, or this is you. Like, somebody's, their chakras are blowed. Yeah, because you're not facing challenges. So, this don't got to be, excuse me, this don't got to be nobody else. I mean, this don't have to be you. I'm sorry. This could be someone else in your energy here. But they definitely is losing. Somebody is losing like... I mean, they just losing, bro. No place like home. You can meet somebody on your way home or something. Just, you know... I know I had said something, too. Um, I had said something, too. I don't know how long ago that was. But it was somebody that was like on the expressway. Or they was driving. It was like, nah, slow down. Pull over there. <laughs> so I'm hunking their horn, trying to talk. They slowing down the other person's speed up. I see somebody slow down speed up. Like, what, what, what's up? Like, what, where, you, where you going? <laughs> Let me ride with you or something like that. Masculine drive one of them little, um, masculine, you got one of them. It, it looks like a go-kart. Y'all know what I'm talking about. It looks like a go-kart, but it's not a go-kart. This masculine got one of them. Somebody going to ask you to ride with them. You going to be riding with this person forever. <laughs> they going to ask you to ride with you. They're like, let me go for a ride. Man, come on, get in. And this man ain't got no wife or anything. 
or this woman, this person ain't got no husband. I feel like it's just going to be very happy, bro. It's somebody that knows what they want that ain't got to go around in circles to know what it is that they want. You know, I feel like nowadays people um, are pretty much everybody is waking up in their own way is what I'm saying. People are just standing up for themselves these days. People are not caring. They're not letting people run over them. What else is here? This is some beautiful energy that you guys are holding, bro. For sure. And it's somebody that's very messy. Clean it up in the reverse. Since their, their life is a mess. What I see it. Their life is a mess. Here and now. Here and now, good things are happening for you. This person is pissed. I don't feel like you care, though. I just truly don't. I don't feel like you have a care in the world for whatever this person is talking about. And um, I feel like, too, that this, this person that's coming in, they're, they're willing to go the distance with you. And even though you may not have met this person quite yet, I can pick up on their character. Their, um, I can pick up on this person, but see, this person was being sent by the most high. It's time for a shift. It's a change that needs to happen. Six of, um, six of cups, basically, with this minute card, but it's in the reverse. Like, you're not you're not willing to mend something with this old energy here. Sephora is significant. Somebody wears a lot of makeup. I mean, a lot of it. It seems like somebody's trying to cover up who they truly are. Nothing is wrong with makeup. I'm just saying, like, somebody wears a lot of makeup. It's like they wear makeup all the time. So it could be something going on with somebody's skin or something. I don't know. Time for now and bliss in the reverse. So this person can't sleep. But see, they can't sleep simply because they don't have any blessings. This person was trying to get around something. They were, they were trying to do something like real low vibing to you in order to get a win. They were, they were trying to get a victory, but they can't. It's, it's nothing here for them. You have a leg up, fam, my friend, for sure. It's something about cotton candy, candy apples, grapes. So, so Okay, so somebody makes like candy, grapes, candy, strawberries, or uh, you may have... Like you may make edibles or something, or you're purchasing this. You did a risk few my seconds. <laughs> you may be purchasing this, but yeah, you're very happy. Or this person that you're meeting, they may they may make these or something. Somebody makes edibles. Like I feel like somebody makes these. I don't feel like you're picking them up, buying them or anything. I feel like you literally make these things. In the kitchen trying to make it raw solid. I'm hearing raw solid by Gucci Mane. Somebody definitely be in the kitchen cooking something here for sale. They be cooking something and selling something. Maybe you be making plates or something. Somebody could be like a candy lady or a candy man. Masculine the candy man. <laughs> I ain't saying your name three times. Masculine fuck that. <laughs> Peace in the reverse, child. Somebody is really disturbed. And this definitely is ludicrous. This is crazy how this person is just they're, it's like they're antsy. Y'all know what I'm saying. I'm saying thank you, Holy Spirit. I'm seeing Rumple still skin. Y'all know when uh on Shrek when he like he was so anxious to do something, his feet started coming out of his shoes. <laughs> I'm saying that like hold up. Yeah, this person right here is real anxious for something. Like they anxious but they're not getting anything. Orphan. That's what I'm saying. Milk and honey reverse. Every, everything that is anything that's positive it belongs to you and i feel like somebody had been stealing from you milk of magnesia is significant magnesium is significant olay is significant somebody could be a bull rider or something or you could be or you could like uh, watching this or something somebody like going to uh the track like watching race horses or something never any story in the reverse something is just over chaos and conflict that's the truth of Ruhani. Somebody's going to watch the fight as well this weekend. Stay strapped right here, masculine. Somebody is causing confusion. It seems like somebody is following someone home or something. This is a feminine energy. Masculine, I just want to say this girl has not ever lived. Film, this man ain't ever left your life. New life is definitely in the reverse. This person, it seems like this person can't breathe, sleep, eat, drink, nothing. They can't do anything without you. You definitely could be a Virgo, bro. Like, you definitely need to go and check out that reading, bro, that I posted for sure. This is somebody who does nothing but spell work. New life coming out again in the reverse community. They're following you around everywhere. This person has no life where this is you. Like, you truly ain't got nothing going on with yourself. This is just really kind of strange here. I'm just saying, it is to me. This is strange. 
So this may be divine feminine getting followed. They're watching, observer, yin, community. Somebody could stay at a roundabout or some or something about a roundabout. Somebody is not leaving. I'm telling you, time to go in the reverse. This is that fatal attraction energy that I've been picking up on. Somebody is literally like a fatal attraction. But it's like you haven't even heard from this person. But see, them be the ones. Like they they never leave your life, bro. We see so many stories of these young women, man. These young women who get their lives taken from these men, bro. These men they get their life taken from these women. They don't know how to walk away from these out, bro. I'm telling you. And it's very sad indeed, but it's like, bro, you have to listen to your intuition, bro. You just truly do. I feel like a lot of people will be alive if they listen to their intuition. And you just simply leave people where they are, bro. You ain't gotta, you ain't gotta get up with people from your old hood or anything like that. Cause you're official. That's just period. These folks is fake, they false, and somebody is literally in despair. I feel like this feminine energy is in despair because she could not pin this child on this masculine or something. She couldn't get something that she wanted by acting like this was this man's kid. And it's just not. The lover's card. This, this person is definitely trying to bring an end to something. They're trying to bring a complete stop, a halt. Masculine, be careful too because your, your ex or something, they're trying to get you locked up. They're trying to get you locked up. They know you're on parole or probation or something. Somebody is really lame in this energy. They really are. This person is trying to make sure you don't have anything. And then to... This is it's somebody trying to pretend like they got more than what they have and they don't got nothing. It's like, okay, but what you acting like that for? Like, why are you acting like you can give me the whole entire world when you just cannot? But this is a whole lot of flexing. And this person also be stealing. I told you this main female, this person is a thief. And this person is some kind of spell work that they're doing is just not working. It's something that's not going to work. It's not going to work. Thoughts, they're thinking about you too. I heard the word manipulate. They're manipulating some bad help. This person is thinking about bringing some kind of bad help to you because they just simply are jealous. This person cannot move on. Bro, I cannot stand nothing more than a person that cannot move on with their life. Bro, that junk is so irritating to me. Luckily, I'm sitting down because I sure cannot stand that. Just like, ill, move on. Like, why are you stealing this person's energy? And it be, it's literally because, like, these people be treating y'all like you ain't nothing. And then when you move on and you, like, what, what is it that you could possibly want? What do you need? You treated this person like they was about, like, bro, ugh. Let me hurry up and get up out this energy, honey. This person is so fake. They're just fake. You're of high value. It's somebody else here. And I feel like that's what they're mad about. Somebody is pissed off because of this mature man. They're mad because this man wants a family. They want marriage something that they could never give you something this woman told you she didn't want kids messing she got an abortion with your baby or something then she turned around and had a baby with someone else i mean but why is she stalking you that's what i'm saying you pick and chose whatever you wanted and then you're not satisfied with your choices you're a horrible judge of character then you must look at yourself when you make a choice and you're not satisfied how is that somebody else's fault that's your fault you're a horrible judge of character like you just are when you're when you're like you mean to tell me you got control of your own decisions and you still make the wrong ones it's you it's not nobody else it's you you don't have any discernment pathway i'm telling you masculine this girl is trying to get you locked up i'm telling you this person has done this on several different occasions all this person does is send you to jail or something when you were with them or something i know i had picked up on a masculine a minute ago where uh, this karmic energy, all they know how to do is call the police or something on this person. Yeah, this person is still on that. Look, you're a twin flame. These cards are now coming out in twos. This person wants you in poverty, but it's them. They're struggling. This person has manifested a life of loss and lack, period. Anything that they had, they lost it. They're always in need of something. But I feel like they're always in need of something because they keep trying to take from you. That's what I'm saying. Stop stealing. Why don't you regenerate and generate something on your own? Little fishy, little sea world. This girl who don't know how to get in the tub. Straight up. She'll get in a tub of blood, but won't get in the tub of water. She'll get in a tub of blood and do a ritual or something. This is just disgusting. This person's energy disgusts me. Or you, whoever you are. I'm just disgusted with whoever you is, okay? Or whoever this is. Coffin car here. 
Occupation reverse journey. I'm saying it's not going to work. Whatever they're trying to do to block you from this new person, it's not going to work. I feel like just stand your ground, bro. Just stand your ground for whatever you believe in, whatever it is you want. That's when you can definitely have it all. Uh, they're misjudging something about you. I feel like this person been had you messed up back in the day. This person had you messed up when y'all was together. They definitely had you messed up then. But this person, is they've been doing a whole lot of, of manipulation. It's a lot of witchcraft and sorcery here. But it's coming to an end. And I know in that Virgo reading I picked up, this person is going to literally pass away. Like, this person is playing games with their own self. Like, these people, somebody got kids, they pregnant and everything. Somebody pregnant, doing spell work and stuff. Like, girl, what is you talking about right here, bro? You're losing. You're just losing. This person doesn't want you. Something that you're not expecting is about to happen for sure. Yeah. This person also is about to be visited by the cops here. That's what I heard. We. They're going to be visited by the cops while they're sitting up here trying to steal from you and trying to call the police on you. They be forgetting, y'all. I keep telling y'all, these folks be forgetting about these warrants and stuff. They be forgetting about these warrants. They be forgetting about these sheriffs and stuff coming to their house. Somebody also finna get a visit from the sheriff. No, the fire marshal is what I heard. Somebody club about to get shut down or they're, they're about to get put out their home. There's too many people in their home or something. I don't know what this is. I heard maximum occupancy. Yeah, this person gonna keep coming up with this stink dress. Just period. They're in bad hill. This this person is in bad hill, not you. I don't feel like you have anything to do with this person's lack of self care. We, I, I don't feel like you're responsible for that. Yeah, courthouse. And see, too, somebody is about to be awarded a whole lot of money in a courthouse situation. This wealthy man is about to lose a lot of money. Y'all people be thinking something is set in stone for you. And you be out here trying to pay people and trying to ruin people's lives because you got money or something. Or you may know people, honey. You're definitely about to lose it. You're not going to be able to steal anything from this person any longer because you've been definitely stealing here. Yeah, I feel like it's this person is going to jail. Somebody is behind the scenes doing something. They're going straight to jail here. Yeah, the lover's card. Don't ever be afraid to live your life, man, masculine. Don't ever march to the beat of nobody drum. Because these folks offbeat anyway. These are some offbeat karmics. What are you talking about? You the only one in this energy that got some rhythm. They got some flavor. It's a bunch of racists food in this energy. These people are so racist. Y'all are dealing with some racist colorist energies here. But other than that, I see a beautiful relationship here. It's a beautiful one. And this person don't got no children. It seems like they don't have no children. They don't have a wife or a husband or something. Like, they're perfect for you is what I'm saying. You may have kids. I don't know. But they don't. This person ain't got no children. I ain't got no children at all. I don't feel like anything is wrong with them. First of all, I feel like this person needs some time in prison or something. They just ain't have time to have children. But see, this person is wasting time. Somebody is wasting time trying to force something to go their way. They want to come and kiss your butt now. They want to come in and kiss your butt. They want to make something right. But it's just all wrong. They've been chasing you the whole time. You don't notice this. It's like you don't even see this person in your energy. They're in their ego. Like I said, this is their fatal attraction energy. This is a fatal attraction. This person is watching every move you're making, which is very, very creepy. It's even more... <clears throat> I heard eyebrow raising that this person won't let go. That's what I'm saying. Because a lot of you guys, you haven't even seen this person. Like, literally in years or something. You haven't seen them, spoken to them, nothing like that. Which is it's kind of strange to me why they're stealing your energy. This person be trolling and everything. Trying to drop little... You know, uh, little slick remarks, trying to dry, say something, trying to dry, you know, um, expose you. Like, they, they, they try to dry, expose you. But like, what? Yeah, they, they're not going to say that it's them. And then, too, whatever this is they're doing is played out. Don't nobody even believe what they're saying. They're clout hungry. Everybody knows that this person is all up in your business. They're getting their karma. They're getting bad karma. You're getting good karma. Good dharma. We, they're creeping and peeking, watching. I'm telling you, you're uninterested in a groupie. This person just simply can't block you. I don't know why they're still here. I'm, I really, this, I'm really questioning this person's existence. 
Because they really have no reason to even be walking the face of this earth. They do the same thing every day. Stalk you. And then they got the nerve to try to run people off. They do. Uh, like if anybody does come into your life. This person right here literally like makes it their mission. To come in and block these people or something. This is not a boss. Whoever this person is. I don't think you knew how much of a loser this person was. And maybe you found out and you just left them alone. But see how they're going around telling lies on you? Never has the facts. Makes stuff up. Lies. Yeah. Pretty much. That's all they know how to do. 25 minutes. Let me just close this off. Now they tripping on shrooms. Because whoever this was they chose over you cannot impersonate you. But I'm telling you, this is a... a this is an ex of yours or something. They won't leave. This person literally will not leave your energy. They're refusing. They may even try to come in and make you a dirty offer. Like I said, this person ain't going to want you until they see you with someone else. And then they're going to come in with this dirty, filthy, nasty, stinking offer that you don't even want anyways here to only keep you in a third party. This person also has a disease. So I want to let you know that too. You need to truly stay away from this person. I don't trust them. They don't want you to reject them. I really think you should. I can't make this up. They got a disease. I knew one of these cards said disease. I just didn't know which one. But yeah, this person has a disease. And it's something that they cannot get rid of. And they got this from like a um a man that want to be a woman or something. Carless. This person lost their car trying to scare you. They're not even truly into you. They just don't want to see you happy with nobody. And I picked that up too. Yeah, you're ignoring this person. They're not the queen rising. This person right here is blocked from traveling as well. I feel like somebody has a warrant. Somebody gonna get locked up and then they're gonna get denied bond as well because they're gonna be like a flight risk or something. That's, that's something completely different. That, like This may be a friend of yours or something that's fighting a case or something like that. Like um, People might be wanting this person to get out but they're not going to because they're a flight risk. This person has a lot of money or something. They're not going to be able to get out. And then this person might literally be on their last strike. They may be moving into the big house, literally. Whoever, somebody also is in your energy. They're not telling you something. They're, they're going through something to where they about to literally lose their freedom. And they're not telling you. They're not telling you the truth about something. So just, I mean, you need to always know what's in your energy. Who's in your energy and what's going on. Because you don't ever get blindsided. You dig a real skill? Yeah. This person right here is sitting back. Getting tarot card readings or something. Somebody also waiting on a reader to send them some kind of information about you. And this person has took their money. <laughs> this, this, whoever this reader is took this person's money. This is not even a true reader or something. This person be going to anybody that got a deck of cards or that they feel like can read some dang on energy. We, they go to them and they, they try to go to many different people to see if they all get the same thing or if somebody else may get a little more detailed or whatever. This person is waiting on something here that they're just simply not going to get because this person is a scammer. <laughs> but, I mean, that's the same thing that their karmic was doing to you. Making up fake profiles in your name, taking people's money. This person is experiencing everything that this person did to you. They're losing, I'm telling you. And it's a beautiful relationship here. Uh, here. This person was trying to put child services on you. They were trying to say you neglect your kids and everything. No, you don't, though. No, you don't. You know exactly who this person is. They sent CPS to your home. Or masculine date. Somebody sent CPS to your baby mama home or something. Or to your feminine. It was her ex. This loser. You may not even have any children with this person. And they had the nerve to send child services to your house. For what? It's because they got some losing children. And they mad because their children ain't yours. They mad because your, your kids are on a better pathway than theirs. They just pissed. Because your kids have a better lifestyle because of you and, and their father. The most high God has made this possible and they're just jealous. These people would never go and get a relationship with my dad. They'll always just sit back and be mad at you, mad at me. They'll just be mad forever. They'll never do the work though. They'll never do anything to get anything. That's what I'm saying. So why do you deserve anything? You won't even do anything. These people won't even work on themselves. They won't even get out of your business long enough to work on themselves. Looking you up trying to steal. Like I said, they're going to any tarot card reader that'll give them any information about you. You dig a real skill? And these people are so off. Like they're like whatever they're talking about is not even accurate or something. It's something about an Acura. 
okay? You're just simply moving on. You're ghosting whatever this is, and that's why they're dirt digging, period. This person is mad because they can't find something. They're trying to find out something about you, but ain't is in the reverse. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. It's in the reverse. Bad reputation is too. These people are so smart. They're stupid and they're not running anything here. Photo proof of what? Nothing. You're not by yourself. Your spiritual team is here moving in silence, stalking them now. Now they're being stalked. I'm telling you, this person definitely called child services on you. This is a loser. They're mad because your bag is up. They're mad. They got a hole in their bag. They mad. Whoever these people are, I don't care. You know, but it's only one way and it's up for you. These people are just stuck. These these people have nothing else to do. They have nowhere to go. They're just simply wasting time. Okay, fam masculine. I'm gonna leave it right here. Remember they got lotion, so do I. Bye guys.